I'm going to stick with my quarterback, Keelan Russell, just to break him down a little bit because I don't think that the Bama fans truly understand what they're getting on their hands. So I evaluated both Jalen, Milrow and Hurst, into going into their senior year. Russell's a better quarterback than both of those guys right now. And I'm not saying better player. I'm saying a better quarterback in terms of throwing the football on time with touch and accuracy and being able to process information in terms of going from the first read, second read, and then he's on the run. Both of those guys came in and were in high school. They were truly dual threat quarterbacks. And when I mean dual threat, both of those guys would rather run than pass the ball. Jalen still struggled two years at Bama, still trying to throw the football. Milrow just got to the point that now he can sit in the pocket and actually go through his progression and make throws. You see Keelan Russell in high school doing those things, yeah. having pocket pressure, having toughness in the pocket, being able to go through one, two reads. Now he's just a half-field reader right now, and his coaches don't ask him to make that full read progression because he's a young kid. So the things that I need to see from him to improve his game going to his senior year is the ability now to go from option one, two, and work his way to three. And his fourth option is his legs. But in terms of throwing the football from the different platform and flicking the ball, he got it. Understanding leadership, we before me, he has 100% of that. From the guys that were out there at the Elite 11 said he is light years ahead of some of the younger guys that's coming in now just in terms of his mentality, his leadership, and his intangibles in order to pull other guys with him.